everybody. It's Friday afternoon. Welcome to Alderac Entertainment Group's Gaming at High Noon. I am John Zinser, the CEO of Alderac Entertainment Group, <laughs> coming at you from the side here. Um, we high are getting right? ready to play Space Space. I'm going to hand you over to Vlad, who's going to introduce everybody and get us started. Hello, everyone, and welcome. Thank you for being with us here today. And here are our guests, Kevin and Melissa, who are joining from Downtram House. Hello. And then I will introduce you to the rest of the people here. We have John DeClaire, the designer of the game. There he John is. John are over there. And then we have Luke and Ross Petersmeet. And then the host for the day will be Ryan Dancy. And we're going back to you, Ryan. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Uh, I'm Ryan Dancy. I'm the Chief Operating Officer at AEG, and I will be your Space Base Admiral for today's game. <laughs> All right, everybody, suit up. It's time to play John D. Clare's game of dice rolling and engine building. You'll need to have your own copy of Space Base to play along. To set up your game, assemble your Space Base player board as per the rules. Place the 12 starting ships on their respective sectors and place your credits tracker at six and your income and victory point tracker cubes at zero. Next, deploy the market. Shuffle the level one, two, and three ships into their respective decks and deal out four ships from each. So you'll have four level one, four level two and four level three rows for a total of 12 ships. It doesn't matter. Then draw a level one ship for each player. That ship gets deployed to your space base in the associated sector. I drew a two, so I'm going to get a sector two ship. Uh, you will take the starting ship in that sector, flip it upside down, slide it under your board, so the red ability is showing. Reduce your credits by the cost of the level one ship that you deployed. Mine cost four, so I'm gonna start the game with two credits, two space bucks. Are you supposed to start with one extra than you normally would, Ryan? Yes, we are all gonna be playing as player number two. Player two starts with a yep. bonus uh, credit. Mm -hmm. So the player two starts with six and then you subtract whatever you paid for your uh, for your first ship. Awesome. All right. Uh, you want to assemble the outposts, which are the uh, cards with the yellow uh, spaceships on them. Uh, as per the rules, just have them nearby. Get your dice warmed up. Make sure they're ready for a good day's work on the space base. Okay. Uh, I'm going to now switch my camera so you can see our layout while I go over the rest of this. All right. Okay. okay. Uh, today we're going to be playing with a special game mode. Wow, I still have my galaxy showing. Let's get rid of the galaxy. That looks cool, but it's hard to see. Too much technology in today's broadcast. All right. Uh, today we're going to be playing with a special game mode that was designed by Luke Peter Schmidt, who's with us today. Uh, in this game, our Dysomatic AI will play as player one and player three. <laughs> Everyone how, on the live how, stream, the Dysomatic AI, <laughs> the Dysomatic AI. Everyone on the live stream, and all of you playing at home, will be all playing together as player two. We're going to use this board to track which player's turn is ongoing and what the die rolls are for player one and player three. On those turns, we'll use the red abilities on the ships we've deployed under our player boards and any green abilities you may have on any of the cards on your board. When it is player two's turn, we will roll our own dice. We'll use the blue and the green abilities on the ships we've deployed to the player boards, but haven't flipped and slipped under the boards. That's just like regular space space. After you've rolled and resolved your ship's abilities, you can go shopping on the market for a new ship. <laughs> if you're playing with more than one person in your local game, keep track of who bought first each turn and rotate that to the next player so everyone has a chance to buy first as we play through the turns. We'll give everyone a few minutes to resolve their turns before we continue to player three's role. 
after player three has rolled, we're also going to roll two dice to determine which rows of the market are going to lose a card. When we roll a one, a two, or a three, we'll remove the level one ship that is farthest from the draw deck. When we roll a four or a five, we'll remove the level two ship that is farthest from the draw deck. And when we roll a six, we'll remove the level three ship that is farthest from the draw deck. After we've removed a ship, we'll slide the remaining ships down and draw a new card from the corresponding deck to replace it. This system keeps the market from becoming stale, but it means you have to keep an eye on that ship you really want so you can buy it before it rolls off the end of the market and vanishes forever. Ryan, I have a question about when we buy ships. If I buy the third ship in the row, the line moves and we put the new ship in the first spot, correct? That is correct. Great. Okay, yes, Ryan. Keep the market. I'm going to say hey. hi to everyone on the chat. Sorry. Okay. Go ahead. And we have Damien, Jay, Amy, Anthony, David, Thomas, and uh, Tori, Alex, Elizabeth, Thomas. Kevin is here too. <laughs> <laughs> and that's all the people that are joining us right now. Please right. remember to share and like this stream. We're going to give to do some giveaways today and depending on the number of people that join us those giveaways get better yeah that's right okay we're going to play 11 turns with this system and after the 11th turn we're going to flip our tracking board over and reveal how the end game works which we'll explain at that time under unlike a normal space based game you don't end the game by getting to 40 victory points we've got a special system that determines how the game ends and we'll discuss it after the 11th turn all right, we're ready to begin. I have turned on the subspace communicator to the Dysomatic AI, and we are going to begin rolling for player one. All right, everyone, let's play space base. Space base. One launch. Okay, we're rolling for player one, and player one rolled a one and a five for a total of six. So the only way you can use those die rolls are if the card you got to start with was a one or a five or a six. Otherwise, it doesn't have any effect for you. Oh, dun, dun, dun. All right. After you've resolved the one or the five or the six, it is time for player two. And everybody rolls dice at home and uses your blue abilities and shops on the market. And in space, no one can hear your dice scream. Right. <laughs> Uh, and they shop in the market, and you get the shop first. I buy first. Yeah. All right. Well, uh, that was actually a pretty good roll for well, Space Base Admiral Me. All right. Uh, do I want to buy anything here? Let's see. I feel like all the pressure is off because Delana's not here. <laughs> My wife is way better at this game than I am, so. Okay. All right. I am going to buy a ship. Okay. All right, everybody ready? All right, now we're going to roll for player three. Player three's roll is a two and a six for a total of eight. Two and six for a total of eight. And again, you'll be using the red abilities. So if you have a two, a six, or an eight flipped over, you will get the benefits. All right, then the last thing we're going to do at the end of the first player, we're going to roll a dice to determine, we're going to roll two dice and we're going to determine what cards are going to come off the market. So I'm rolling and I rolled a two and a five. So we're going to take a level one card off the end of the market, the card that's farthest away from the level one stack. And we're going to slide all the level one cards down one and then replace that from the draw deck. We lost level three. And we're going to do the same thing for a number two card. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay, that is the end of the first turn. We're going to have 11 turns just like that, and then we'll explain how the end game is going to work. Yeah, no, I was just taking them back. Yeah. Go into player, uh, go into round number two. Roll better, Ryan. Sorry? Roll better. <laughs> Roll better. Vlad, Vlad are, we, uh, are we okay on the graphics? Yes, just a little bit more of time, and I will be doing great, but we are showing okay, I'll, everything. I'll, <laughs> I'll try to slow it down just a bit. I'll, I'll mention uh, as we're playing, if you happen to reveal the uh, UES Gordon, 
which is the uh, the level three ship, which allows you to uh, spend a power cube to cause your opponents to lose four victory points. We recommend that you you just remove that ship from the game since uh, you can't really inflict the negative four on anybody, unless you happen to be playing with a friend, in which case it's it's mean. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we will roll for player one at the start of turn number two. Player one rolled a two and a six trash. for a total of eight. Mm -hmm. Terrible. Nothing. Oh. Total trash. All right. Well, thanks. You are screaming in space. I got one. Good, yeah. Good roll. I mean, I got no. Two's no great. <laughs> all right, everybody. Now it's time for player two. That's everybody. So we are all going to roll our own dice at home. <laughs> And oh, roll your die roll oh, and go shopping oh, in your local market. Dingo! Oh, did you just uh, oh. <laughs> oh, I got three. I'm first to buy this time. Yeah, it matters. All right. You All can, right. You can buy any. Uh, you can okay. go up to seven, also. I can go up to seven. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm into the second row. Me too. I'm into the second row. All right. I'm gonna buy. Ooh, this is a tough call. A seven cost. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna put a I'm gonna I'm put a ship in second row. Ships. Anybody who plays craps knows that on two d six seven is the most common roll. But and in this game, there's math. no downside. In space based math, it's the six. <laughs> space based math is the six. I'm spending eight dollars. Eight coins. You got eight coins? Yeah, man. Uh, Thanks for rolling. Uh, it's a Ferengi sitting best. next to you over there. I think. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the Millennium Falcon. Okay. You're smuggling nice. something. I'm smuggling some stuff. That's smuggling. Nice. All right. Check that storage hold. That's the that's the ship that made the Kessel Run in eight parsecs or something. Like that. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay, everybody, we're gonna roll for player three. And the player three roll is a three and a four. Yeah. You know, I got Thank some you. special dice for player three today, and I thought they would show up on camera better, but they just don't. So I'm going to make an executive decision and swap dice. All right. <laughs> well, no, we're, okay. we're also showing <laughs> dice on the screen, Ryan. Oh, that's good. Okay, good. Yeah, we last week uh, I realized after the fact that um, the dice that we had used to roll the uh, cards off the market were effectively invisible because they were black pips on clear, transparent background. Oh, wow. So, Trying to trying to make it a little bit better to see. All right, three and four. Okay. Uh, that was do I great. I love that. Four, Two seven. coins for that one for me. No. Oh, I do have a me seven. Too. See that seven paid off. They're math. All right, I'm now going to roll the two dice that are going to determine what cards are going to come off the market. I rolled a three and a five. So we're going to roll the number one off, and we're going to roll a number two off. Oh, that was a good card. I was sorry to see that go. Yeah, you didn't get any money. Oh, well. Hmm? You didn't get any money. Okay. It's almost like there was another player hate drafting. Two rounds to get one dollar. That's all I need. All right, Vlad, are we good on the graphics? We're good on the graphics. Thank you. All right. I'm going to move the turn mm -hmm. marker to player three, turn three. My goal is to get uh, before we get started on turn three, do we want to talk about Dead Reckoning? We got that box showing. It looks beautiful. Oh yes. So really? the box you see on uh, on the yeah, <laughs> you look so confused. That's not space base, right? <laughs> that isn't space base. What could it be? That's Dead Reckoning, our oh. upcoming game of card crafting and swashbuckling, by the renowned legendary game designer who also designed Space Base, John Clay. John oh. Clay. John Clay. Yay. Yeah. yeah. This game is fantastic. If you want to follow it on Kickstarter, Vlad's going to put a link in the chat. Uh, it's coming out this summer. It is spectacular. You'll never uh, look at a cube tower the same way again. Uh, it's Wait, a great hard. 4X game that uses card drafting as its main engine, but still gives you all that awesome 4X stuff of exploring and exterminating and stuff. It's great. Like Mystic Veil? Vale? It's like a yeah. Mystic Veil powered ship. <laughs> what a great <laughs> shelfie. Yes, well done. So okay, check it out. Start I turn three. Like. Ready to start turn three? I will roll for player one. Uh, I've rolled a three and a five. I like that. Total of eight. Melissa? Oh, I finally, you finally got a coin, Melissa. Get I get coin. a coin. Oh, it works. It all, it all works. First one. <laughs> Everything is okay. <laughs> Oh, All right, after oh, you resolve the three to five, uh, go ahead and roll for yourself. I got right this. Player two's two. turn. Ooh, I rolled, five I rolled the big six. number. We're going to 11. Ooh. 
problem is. I really want both of those. Do we, when do we get income? If you like, I'm just going to take the six twice and then go shopping on your local markets. Yeah. All right, you turn to buy first. You buying something, Kevin? I have four yeah. coins. You're buying. I'm going big. I'm going big. Let's do it. Ouch. Going big. Four coins. How much can I buy? I can't right, buy nothing. The price right. is here. Yeah. I am. Um, I'm loading up the middle of my board. I'm going with a. I'm going with a with a with a bell curve shaped strategy today. I think I'm gonna hold off. I'm gonna buy this one for three. One, two, three. Oh, which I never go below one now. Right. I'm gonna buy this one. That was big. That was big. That was huge. Oh, that was three. All right, we're gonna get ready to go to player three. Everybody at home's good. Yep. All yep. right, player three's roll <laughs> is ten. A four and a five. Ten. Oh. <laughs> five. No. Five. Got five. Five. Ten. Just one less. Yeah. So that's nine. Three coins uh, for me. Wow. Four. Good job, uh, Melissa. Made bank there. <laughs> 54 on the hop. <laughs> I knew you were going to say that. <laughs> so tell us what interesting things are happening at Tantrum House. Yeah. Oh, Tantrum House. Doing videos, doing live streams, trying to do more now that uh, we're sort of separate. <laughs> but uh, are, you, are you managing to get much game playing in? Oh yeah, I mean we we definitely can do gameplay over over online, but also since uh, we have different studios, we can play with each other. So Melissa and I have been playing some two player games and things like that. So right. and we usually don't play a lot two players, yeah. so uh, <laughs> it, it's it's different. Yeah, yeah. Co op games are fun. So right. Do you have your Do you have your marriage counselor on speed dial? That's right. <laughs> <laughs> well, wow. I'm still going into work each day, so I'm not. Oh, home. We're okay. not home okay. all day yes. together. Yeah. Okay. All right. I'm going to roll for the market uh, changes. I rolled two threes. I rolled six the hard way. So we're going to take off two number one ships. Oh, yours. Six the hard way. There are hard way cards in space space, but they are promo cards. They're hard to get. The promo uh, cards? Point, I think we're going to have them in the online store. Oh, yeah. We had them on our Kickstarter last year, and oh, we have one. people that are still wanting them. I think okay. uh, I think we have 100 people that are like on a wait list. And I said, well, maybe someday. <laughs> okay. yeah, the, it's a Dreadnought pack, right? Yep. That's right. Yeah. yeah. Uh, you have 100 people that are waiting for us to get you Dreadnought packs. Yes. I will fix Ouch. that problem. <laughs> problem... Solved. All right. We'll talk. We'll talk after. <laughs> yeah. No worries. Yay, I did not. I did not know about that. I will make sure that gets fixed. No, that's uh, fine. Right okay. Roll ten. Go to turn four, and roll the diceomatic for player one. He rolled a one and a okay. six. Oh, oh, that was bad for me. A little of seven. Oh, that was that was really nothing bad. for you either. Uh, I really need to get a seven. Really like a, a stormtrooper yeah. up there, right? No. <laughs> Man, I should have gotten that one earlier. I'll take the two bucks. All right, after you have resolved the one and the six, roll at home for yourself. Two and a two. Roll at home for yourself. I get two uh, points, or I could take two dollars. Yeah, I didn't see both. That's three dollars for me either way. I'm back at six credits. Six I, I can buy first. Was there anything worth four dollars? The nine. Where am I going? Oh, there's something that's worth one. Oh, I can get a one. I think I might do that. I'm going to spend uh, somebody else's turn now. Yeah. Anybody. Oh, my turn. Dude, I'm going to get else. this one because it was a one. Ones are nice. I'm going to buy. They're nice. I'm, I'm going to. You're going to hold? hold. All right. Melissa's holding. She's oh, going to go for go. the big guns. The big hold. <laughs> <laughs> it, can, it can be a powerful or risky move. I'm sure she'll win from it. All right. <laughs> I was getting myself into trouble, and I all right. <laughs> okay, that was uh, that was our turn, player two. So now it's time for player three. You saving your twelve dollars? What did we get? Player three rolled a two and a three. Yeah. Total two five. and a three. Two That's three. three coins for me. One, two, nice. three. Nice. I got two coins out of that. One. That did not suck. That was good. Need a oh. should have bought that. Just to let everybody know at home, we do not currently have the shy Pluto cards in this setup. 
We didn't want to accidentally spoil anything for anybody. If you happen to have Shy Pluto, you're more than welcome to play with Shy Pluto. Uh, it'll work just fine. Um, all, this, all the secret stuff and all the mystery boxes will work great. You just have to manage that on your own side, your own end. Um, Shy Pluto is uh, the first expansion for Space Base, and it is what we call a saga expansion. It is not a legacy expansion. You don't alter or destroy any components, but as you play it, you're going to add cards and new components into the game. And if you ever want to reset back to the base game, it's really easy to do. Uh, in fact, I, we had uh, Shy Pluto in our game, and I took it all out to do these uh, online games. It's worked really well. Yeah, we did too. We had Shy Pluto in ours, and it was really easy to separate them out. So Yeah. Uh, and I actually got word from our warehouse this morning, like literally like 15 minutes before this call started, that Space Space has been received. And so we are going to have more Space Space in our online store shortly, and it will be going out to the wholesalers and the distributors. And you'll be able to get that if you've been waiting for an order to get filled. It is in our warehouse and on its way. Cool. That's great news. Right. Yeah, it was. Everyone on the chat wants Dreadnought packs. So if you have any idea what? for them, Dreadnought packs, <laughs> space based promo. Can we just get it up on the online store immediately, please? <laughs> All right, I'm going to roll uh, the dice for the uh, market changes. I rolled a four and a six. Four and a six. So we're going to take uh, a level two off, and we're going to take a level three off. Ryan, that's not the role I want it to be a 10. <laughs> yeah, you wanted another another 10. A, a I need a 10 time. when it counts. Okay. I'll give you my Venmo address, and you can, uh, <laughs> you can li liquidate the wheels of commerce. Okay, we're going to go to turn five. Now is when it counts. We're going to start with player one, and the Dysomatic has rolled a three and oh, a four. Yeah. Ooh, that's oh, three and a <laughs> Another Still seven. That so that's a seven. You could have bought that seven earlier. <sighs> seven. It was right there. Seven and ten eleven. All right. Uh, after you guys have resolved your three and your four, uh, or your seven, it's time to roll for yourself. I can go up to eleven coins. That was uh, not a bad roll. <laughs> All right, you go first. All right, I am living at six credits by the time I get to the market. Oh, I know what I'm doing. If you, <laughs> yes, if I don't take it. If you don't take it, I'm taking it. Yeah. Uh -oh. <laughs> oh. Too many. There's two good choices here. What you doing? All right, I'm She's taking it. Now. She's going for it. Okay. All right, I'm gonna take this nine. Nine coins. All right, I finally took my first victory point card. Let's see if I can actually start scoring some points. That's the card I need. That's game over. If I All right, we're waiting for the three to roll. Uh, that's what I was All right, ready to Turn one, that's what I was doing. <laughs> <laughs> Is it turn player three now, Ryan? Yeah, roll a 10, it Ryan. Time for player Come on, player three. three. Come on, player three. Roll a 10. Player three rolled a two and a six. Yes. Two and a six is eight. For a total of eight. I'll do okay, coin. now we need a six on one of these two rolls. <laughs> Don't do it. Now you need a six. All right. You're Don't trying to get it. Here we go. Now. Here it is. All right, I'm rolling six. for the market upgrade, and it is no. two twos. Two twos. Uh, it's I'm lucky like, Ted. Oh, well. Sorry. Uh, we're going to drop two number ones. What do you have in the uh, in the six slot in the in the in the late rank three card, John? John's what got the to... swap, the four and the ten spots, and he's got his ten oh. loaded for bear. That's a game <laughs> Oh, oh, it's like advanced uh, space based strategy there. Moving <laughs> things around. It's, it's, a like, game if he gets it. it's like he knows how to play. Or something. <laughs> yeah, right? He doesn't suck. That's for sure. We're gonna make John play with a handicap of only getting to use one dice. This is this is an all-in strategy, though. This is yeah. if it works, it's going to work really well. If it cra if Ryan never rolls a ten, I'm screwed. Okay, I'm going to just scratch the sixes off these dice. All right, we're going <laughs> to turn number six, and we're going to roll for player number one. And I roll ah! four and a five. <laughs> five. Four and a five. Like I like that. Sorry, not a ten. Got three more coins. Well, that's a nine. Yeah. I get six coins oh, on income. What? what? Possible what? Roll. That roll was awful. No, that's good. That's good money. I want to spend a cube to reduce my total by one, not increase my total by one. 
Now we can. All right, uh, it's time to roll at home. Everybody gets yeah, to roll dice for yourself. Here we go. Wow, I rolled box cars again. Seven, five, and a two. And I am back at six space box. Nine. Oh, I have been at six credits every single turn when I get to buy, trying to buy. Ten credits. I have nine credits. Mm -hmm. I think I'm going to. Wow. Well, I'm going to. I'm, I'm going to hold. I'm just no, going to. I'm going to buy this one. <laughs> I'm going to buy it. I'm going to buy it. All right. I'm going to have a tower of seven by the time. Which is that? Eight coins. I need to buy some points. Right there. I know. One more round and I get there. Come on. I, I believe. I believe. All right. Everybody done shopping at home? Yeah. Believe me, Ryan. All right. Here comes player three. It is a two Six. and a four. Awesome. A two and a four. Two, and a four. two coins for me. What do you got, Melissa? Three coins. Very nice. Ooh. Ooh. That was a two Come and on. a four, you said? Two and a four. Two and a four. And the All right, big six, big six. Oh. I got it. I rolled a four and a six. Oh, is that drop a number two? Here we go. And we're gonna drop a number three. Oh, and it cleared that one. <laughs> uh oh. Drafting. And I can use R hate drafting. Oh, and ten is the mm -hmm. only way to go now. But. Who's hate drafting? <laughs> the dice. I got hate drafted by the dice. That's right. Heavenly hate drafted. All right. We're getting ready to go to turn number seven. Oh, man. Vlad, how are we doing on the script? Have we skipped anything? Um, I'm, I'm not sure. I'm, I'm doing the other stuff. <laughs> oh, okay, no. <laughs> you know what we can talk about? If, if you haven't played uh, Richard Garfield's ga great game, Greedy Goblins, it is right. on sale right now on the AG web store for half price just That's because right. the Tantrum House people are here. That's what we do. <laughs> Woo! <Yay! laughs> That's right. That's awesome. There you go. All right. Uh, I'm going to roll for player one. On player top. one. Player one at the top of player of turn seven. I rolled a two and a four. Two coins. Ooh, two three and a four. coins for me. Oh, Melissa's getting this. Oh, you get. Oh, your 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 credits are doing well over there. Oh, I can buy from the top row. Uh oh. Uh, uh oh. <laughs> That's not good. Go well, start rolling for it. All right, everybody, roll for yourself. She's on the top row. That yes, is she is. All right. I'm gonna let you. Uh, do you have a 10? Do you get an income or a four coins? Yeah, she is. She has 18 credits. What? Not not realistic. How is that even possible? I have three credits. <laughs> <laughs> I, I've been very cheap in my buying. That's right. Okay. Frugal. We call it frugal here. <laughs> That's, right. That's right. All right. All right I'm going to stick a, a four victory point card in my 12 sector. I've rolled 12 twice already, so maybe I'm just I am the numbers today. I am you already used up all the 12s now. Anything. Yeah, that's... Your, your quota that's for 12s is used up, Ryan. That's not how dice work, John. <laughs> well, luckily, I, I do have the ability to manipulate the dice once to increase my die roll, oh, so no. I technically can score that oh, on an 11 as well. Peter. All right, we're going to roll for player three. I'm going to do that one. Player three got a one and a two. A one and a two. The worst. The worst. Three more. Wasn't that bad. Good job, Melissa. All right, I need I need them. I need a one. I need them to roll a nine for me. And uh, the market adjustment <laughs> is a one and a five, so we're gonna roll off a level one uh, ship and a level two ship. Okay. I need cool. to get some cash here. I need to get out of the we, get out of the level we're one ship. Close to the uh, space base needs an upgrade. Okay. Level eight. We're going to turn eight already? What? We're on turn eight. Yeah. Yeah. What? <laughs> Come All on. Right, here we go. Nine, 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 nine. Player one on turn eight. It is two oh, twos. No. More bucks. I'll take it. Another oh, lucky turn. I made some money that dollars. round. What? What? Excuse me. <laughs> All the money. Wow. That's nice, Melissa. All right. After you've done your two twos, uh, roll for yourself. Yeah. Can we uh, on ten? Start here? Can we what loop? Can we get rid of cards from the two points matrix point. there? I did. It was a okay. one and a five. You should have lost a level one and a level two. Yeah. Deep trouble. What tens? Four, 
So, right. since we're playing a dice game, I'm it's a great moment to tell everyone that all right. our dice games are 25% off on the online store. So, right. it's a great time for you to go and grab your copy of those games. Cool. Yeah, right. absolutely. Hey. Yeah, alderactstore.com. Let's take this moment to talk about some of our favorite games from other companies. I just got in a couple of cool Kickstarters from people that I know. I got in um, the D6 role-playing board game. And um, I got in... Um, Goblin King, right? The Goblin King, yeah. Johnson's are only likes card dice games, the card game. <laughs> yeah. Goblin King is angry, which looks great. I also well got my, I oh, also got Tang my Garden. really nice Kickstarter. Yeah. Oh. It was it's blank. <laughs> yeah, I know. Let's yeah. show that well. Okay, let's see. Now you can That's see good. it. Yeah. Nice. Tang Garden. Yeah, that, that was a really big box. And I'm still figuring out how I'm going to pay those, that shipping, but it's an amazing game. <laughs> that is a good game. All right. Where are we at, Ryan? Uh, we are going to roll for player. We are going to roll to resolve the market. No, we already did that, right? No, we need to roll for player three, Ryan. Player three. Player three. Mm -hmm. player three. All right. We're on player three. And I rolled a two and a three. Two and a three. Total five. Two and a three. I guess I'll take three coins. All right. We rolled a lot of nine and my rolls. I sort of am. Ryan's rolled nine like three times. But if I rolled a nine to resolve the market changes, I rolled a two and a three, so we're going to lose two level one ships. All right, I feel like we should do a check in now on scores. Mine is very easy. I have no points. <laughs> uh, let's see, Luke, how many points do you have? I have two. I also have two. Rose has two. John Zinzer, how many points do you have? I have four. John Claire, how many points do you have? Big zero. I need a. I need to roll a ten. <laughs> Kevin, how many points do you have? I have two points. I have zero points. All right. Woo! So winning. <laughs> just like last week, I'm just going to remind everybody that this game tends to accelerate the more cards get flipped and the more cards get bought. And so it might seem like things are a little slow right now, but I expect the scores are going to start to go up quickly uh, now that a lot of people have uh, opportunities to use their engines and get their boards to score. Come on, nine. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. <laughs> All right. We're going to the top of player uh, turn number nine. This will be the roll for player one. And I rolled a one and a two. All right. Wow, I'll take two, two points. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. One we roll, roll player two. two. And we roll a one and a two. Two, two one. Two one. Three. People at home will notice yeah, that I've got all the multicolored uh, space based dice with the cool, you know, space based ship on them. You can get those in the command station uh, for the space base. Okay, five so coins. Set a dice in there for up to six three points and a coin. Ham, this has got choices. Oh, choices. All right, roll for yourself. Oh, that's too good. Everybody roll at home. Oh, I rolled a seven. That's that was good. weak yeah. sauce. Yeah, I feel bad about it was that. a good roll for me. Ooh, Jay has 12 points on the chat right now. All right. Oh, Mike has 11. Take a hike, Jay. I'm into the third row. Ow. <laughs> 14. John Sincer, are we going to do a giveaway today? I don't know. Let me do it. 14 points. Of course we're going to do a giveaway today. Let's John ask our friends at Tantrum House yeah. which game <laughs> they would like for us to give away today. Right. Oh, oh tantrum, tantrum house. house. We get to, uh, so we have. Uh, are you doing like a tiny towns with a new expansion bundle? Ooh, we sure, could, we can do that. We don't have tiny towns in stock. We uh, we're we're waiting for some fresh uh, inventory <laughs> yeah, yeah. to arrive on. Okay. On the fortune expansion, but we could just hold it until it's here. It'll be here sometime in May, so it's not that far out. <laughs> I mean, so Vail, so. Mystic Veil vale is another one, another good one if you have that in stock. Uh, yeah. Let's do that one because we got John here and uh, another great yeah. John. Absolutely. Good. Should we do should we do basic and uh, the Nemesis expansion, the brand new expansion? Ooh. Sure. Yeah, yeah. Awesome. All right. Great. Thank you. Thank are you. Are we going to have trivia? What are we going to do? What number am I thinking? <laughs> Ten. No, Ten. Don't, don't do that to me, John. Don't it's 17. <laughs> Always lucky, Ted. Is it 10? <laughs> Not 10. Good try, though. All right. All right, while the people at home are guessing what number John's thinking of, I'm going to roll for player three. Uh -huh. Come on, nine or ten. I rolled a five and a two. It's a seven. 
Okay. Woo! Woo! Ryan, you roll. Good, 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 good roll. Good roll. Whoa. Five points. That is get nine point, space bucks and a victory point. I am on the board. You're okay. killing me, Ryan. Man, David are says awful. eight. Tori says five. Anthony says 42. <laughs> Andy says four. Amy says 17. Jay says 17. Justin says seven. Mike says 10. Mark says D20. Amy says 57. Seven and Susie says 13. And Amy gives me another 23. And I Who said 13? Who said 13? Who said 13? Susie. Susie says 13. Susie. Susie. Yeah. Thank you, Susie, for saving me. <laughs> right on Vlad will uh Vlad where the will points are made up and nothing matters <laughs> yeah. all right okay uh I'm gonna roll for the market adjustment uh I rolled a three and a six so we're gonna take off a level one and we're gonna take off a level three something useful fun. okay finally it is time for Come turn on. number 10. Nine or 10. I'd like it. Rolling rolling for player one. Here we go. Give me a second, Ryan, please. Wow. All right. Two and three. I'll, I'll hide this knowledge well with that. What was that, a one and a two again? Two and a three. It's a secret. Apparently it's a secret, though. A three coin, three credits, Melissa? Mm -hmm. So me now too. we are in round 10. Round 10. OK, please. Give All right, me roll two number. And three. Come on, 10. What, what did player Ten. three roll? Or player one? Two and, and three. two and a three. Thank I'm you. I'm gonna take two points and two coins. And after you have done resolving uh, player uh, player number one, you're gonna roll for your thing. I'm not purchasing anything. So. Oh, that's snake eyes. That is four victory points. Right on. It's a good feeling to be in the game. I'm going to double that one. Uh, and I've got 11 space bucks. What? <laughs> no, no. I'll go first. Left. You go first. Okay. It gives you a chance to hate draft. But, but for that much money, it's probably not, probably not worth my time. Four dollars. Oh, I have so many difficult choices. Well, people are thinking. I'd highly recommend getting the command station if you don't have it yet, too. Yeah, it's awesome. Yeah. It's great. And, 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 it'll, and it'll let you put the cards from the next expansion that is coming. Yeah. Ooh, that's good to hear. Yeah, and we are probably going to send you some additional info on that. At some point during the following months. So All right. you guys like what we're doing. <laughs> Love space space. Love more space space content. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The oh. best thing about command station is that you get your own dice. Yes. I know. I have I'm rolling uh like a yellowish orange. I have purple. All okay. right, Ryan, what's up? Roll for player three. Ten. Player three. I rolled a one and a two. Jesus. Oh, wow, you're rolling low. Low. Yeah. Fuck, Ryan. Low. <laughs> I'm gonna take two coins. So low. Either way. Literally the worst. You're getting three coins. Either either one, one or two, like five it's times. So this bad. Game. I'm sitting here. Like, eight, nine, he's been ten. doing well for you. Yeah. There's two. Not, two I'm man. rolling and playing. Wow. Here. There's no. There's no dice manipulation going on. Yeah, there is. <laughs> All right, uh, and then I'm gonna roll for the market changes. I rolled a one and a four, so we're gonna lose a number one and a number two ship. All right, players, this, this is going to be the start of turn 11, and that will be the final round of the normal rolls. Dun, dun, dun. When this turn is over, we will flip the board over, and I will explain how the end game system works. Oh, this turn is going to be Come on, nine normal. or 10. That's all I need. Nine or 10. I guess. You're going right. to do that, and I'm going to figure it out if my flipping graphic works. Okay. <laughs> all right, we're going to roll for player one. Player one on the eleventh turn. Player one rolled a two a and a four. Melissa, wow! Oh, so four. Six coins for me. Wow! <laughs> wow! 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 Come on, ten. Such trash. Woo! Just roll a ten. Seven points. Oh, nine. That's good. Reminds me of the time I hit the jackpot at the Vegas airport on a nickel slot. <laughs> I am uh, not purchasing. Clank, 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 clank. That went on forever. <laughs> All right, uh, after you've resolved the two and the four, it's time to roll for yourself. Everybody rolls for player two. I rolled oh, yeah. another hard four. 
I'm going to turn my oh, man, four. Man, we are close on points, aren't we? I'm going to score three more victory You're doing points. better, though. Oh. I'm going to not shop on the markets. Okay, are we ready for player three? Are we home good? Almost, Ryan, almost. Oh, no worries. <laughs> you you going to do it? You, uh, Way you're thinking about it. I need a 112, Ryan. Here it comes. It's 36 to 1, but it pays 30 to 1. It's not 10 yet. By so. the casino, always wins. <laughs> yeah, your nay. All right. Okay, it's time to roll good. for player three. Come on, 9 or 10. Come on. And player three rolled a 1 and a 4. <laughs> what? A 1 the? and a 4. <laughs> four <laughs> <to five. laughs> mm -hmm. That didn't sound like that. gives you three coins you either mm -hmm. way. I think nice. John said uh, 1 and 4, right? Yeah. 1 and 4. Yeah. That's what he asked for. And I'm going to roll for the market change. It's also a one and a four. That was easy. We're going to lose a number one ship and a number two ship. Okay. It is the end of the 11th turn. And it oh, is time man. to go. To the I'm end scared. Game. Hey, can right. we get a, We're gonna, let's get a score check while Ryan is flipping the board over. Two points. That sounds good. Uh, I, have, uh, oh, I, I have eight points. Ryan has eight. I have seven. John has two. I have 11. Whoa. I have eight. Nice. Nine. Eight. Eight. I'm in dire. Rose, how you doing? Six. Rose has six. Okay. All right. I have flipped the board over, and Vlad has attempted to commercially flip the board over. And it's work. So we have both boards. It works. <laughs> okay. Here is how the end game system works. Normally, in a game of space space, the game ends when a player goes to 40 points or more. And then every player has a chance to end their have a final turn, and then you score. But that's not how Space Base at Home works, because we have no idea who's actually at 40 points. So the way this is going to work is, every time I roll the dice for player one and player three, we're going to mark that die roll on this chart. And we're going to keep playing until we roll the same pair of numbers a second time. So the game could end in two turns. It will probably end in seven to eight turns. It could oh, go much longer. Hey. A little bit random. Other than that, we're going to play the turns exactly as normal. So this is technically turn 12. So if you are Again. keeping track of who buys first, this is an even number turn. All right, I'm going to roll for player one. Uh, player one rolled a one and a two. Wow. Yeah. Wow. wow. Oh, this wow. game is going to end quick. Yeah, we've been wow. Right, right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Two. He's going to roll a one and a two again. <laughs> so right. Ryan, mark the one and the two. So we're going Come to mark on. the one and the two on the roll. Right. Everybody rolls at home. Ten. Roll for yourself at home, everyone. Yeah, Ryan, explain Three. how the marker works for the roll. Explain how the marker works for the roll. So I rolled a one and a two. So I marked the one and the two. And... If I roll a one and a two again, the game will end. I'm buying something. <laughs> and uh, by the way, when we say the game ends, it doesn't matter uh, if player three rolls it. I mean, three uh, all the way around and player two, everybody home will get one final turn. And Ryan, so you, so do you mark the board when player three rolls. How much do you have? I, I will Ooh, mark yeah. the board when That's player nice three for you. rolls. Yes. Thank you. Obvious, yeah, we're marking twice. Yep. Uh, okay, so I just uh, rolled a hard 10. I scored nice. Nine 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 nine. Nine. <laughs> I am at 14. I have six credits to spend. Wow. And I think I'm going to do the one that gets me a victory point if I get lucky. All right. Okay, everybody good at home? Yeah, nine plus seven. Are you already got a couple points? Nine or ten, no, Ryan. Oh, okay. right. Ryan. Mm -hmm. About time to roll something that doesn't suck. All right, I'm rolling for player three. Player three rolled a two and a six. No! Total of eight. eight in the hole. Two and a six. Oh, one more would have been amazing. Two and a six. Oh, that's interesting. You know, one more would have been amazing. A nine would have been great. <laughs> no, not a point. I'm going to say a money. All right. Um, that, okay, we're going to roll for the market changes. I rolled a two and a four. So we're going to do a level one ship and a level two ship. Oops. Come on, nine or ten. Come on, nine right. or ten. Where do we go oh, to get the same thing now? Huh? Guys, <laughs> That's not what, good what's news the best news. place for people to find you on the web? Our Oh, for us, uh, tantrumhouse.com, or you can look at our YouTube channel, Tantrum House, for, um, for all our videos that come out. 
or right. our Facebook channel. Yeah, Facebook channel too. We've been starting to do some more live streaming on that for fun. So very cool. Awesome. Live stream coming up. Our live stream will be Saturday tomorrow at one p.m. Okay. Nice. What are you playing? We are playing Death Eaters Rising from the Op. Oh, cool. cool. Nice. Yeah. A Harry Potter game. Yes. I'll be wearing my uh, Ravenclaw shirt and for I'll that one. And wear Gryffindor. <laughs> I appreciate people who come dressed to play. Obviously. Yeah. Obviously. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Ryan. <laughs> hey, Ryan, don't roll one and a two here. Yeah, one and two. Right, here I comes. I'm not rolling for player one. I rolled. Oh, come on. Cars. There it is, folks. Fox cars? The biggest number, six, six. Yes! I, I know. No. This you is still haven't rolled a 10 the whole, whole game. game. Is this, this nice, oh, needs to nothing. Come back is it 12? Room, but yeah, it's, six. it's 12. And just okay. nothing for me. He has not it's rolled a single 10 the whole game. Uh, wow. Okay. And nothing. And now I hit on nines also and eights, but you still don't roll those. Right? All right. Well, roll for yourself. I love you. <laughs> oh, man, I needed a 10. Yes. There's a four and a two again. Four. I'm just going to take the two points. One, two, three, and the two gets me. Susie's saying that she nine. loves Tantrum House's videos. Oh, thank you. Thanks, Susie. That is nice. Yeah. All right, I have eight gold. All right, I rolled a 10. We're planning our Kickstarter campaign probably the end of May, too. So. Excellent. Nice. Yeah, we'll definitely want to help out with that. Yeah. For sure. Awesome. All right. What am I going to buy here? Melissa, are you buying anything? Uh, She's thinking. thinking. I'm not purchasing anything. I kind of want a point check. All right. How much do you have? Winning winning all of a I have to be winning all of a sudden. Yeah, that's good for you. Stop. All right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to load up my 11. Eights, nines, and tens work for me, and instead you get your box cars. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, box cars, baby! <laughs> Come on, player three. All right, it's time for player three. Everybody ready? Come on, player three. Player three. Player, three. player three rolled a two and a four. What? <laughs> two and a four, predictably right down the middle. Six coins. Six coins for Melissa. She's rolling in the credits. Oh. Two and four. Just now she's got to turn that, that the money into victory points. She's doing well. She's got 19. Okay, that's a good score. Uh, let me roll for the market adjustment, and then we'll do a score update. The market adjustment is a four and a six. So we're going to roll off a uh, level two, and we're going to roll off a level three. Okay. All right, let's do a score update. I have 14 points. I need this to hit multiple times. In the body. I have 22. Points you have? Ooh, three points. <laughs> <laughs> Luke, I have, what's the score? I have uh, 16 points. Kevin Kevin has, what's the score? Uh, go for it. Rose has got what? Oh, we have at 18, Melissa? 19. All right. John, what do you got? I have 22. Woo. 22. And John Claire? Three points. <laughs> Three <laughs> points. That's because he's not rolling 10. Uh, Look I, at all I those went big points. 10. I went big 10s this game, and you haven't rolled one the whole game. I know. Uh, I'm, I'm going to roll for player one. I, I now can get my 10 on eights, nines, and 10s, though, and you still haven't rolled an eight, nine, or a 10. Here we go. Uh, I'm going to roll, and there may be technical difficulties if I roll a 10. We'll see. Okay, here we go. Uh, I rolled an eight. Hey, no. A, a three what? and a five. Three I get five. there with the charge. Eight. What do you get for three and a five, Melissa? Two coins, two oh. points. Wow, that's nice. Wow. Ryan, no more I think you're missing the marker on the four and the two from previous rounds. Uh, 12 points. I'm missing the market. So we don't mark the market. We just mark the uh, the, the player one and player three. Yeah, sorry. You're yeah. Mean, uh, yeah. Was that player one that just rolled, Ryan? That was player one. Oh, so it's player two. There's going to be five yes. things marked now. Come on, ten. I can roll yeah. a ten, right? We're, we're missing one in the four and the two. We're missing one on the four and the two. All right, very good. I'm sorry. I will correct that mistake. 42, the ultimate answer to the question of life, the universe, and everything. All right, now roll for yourself. Oh, Melissa, what do you roll? Right. And Mike's saying that he has 27 points on the chat. Wow. Good job, Mike. Uh, all right. Good job. Gonna, all right. Jump. Come on, play. I'm going to score three victory points. Oh, here it comes. I only got it. It took, it took 110 to get me to 15, 14 points. Wow. wow. Here he comes. And it wasn't even a 10. It was an 8. <laughs> all right. Have you guys all shopped at home? Everybody ready to go to player 3? Let's do yes. player 3. 
Player three is a two and a four. That is wow. the game. That's the game of the game. Oh. End of the game. Oh, that's the end? No. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna manipulate the market one last time. I forget where this was. Uh, it's a two and a four. So uh, I rolled a two and a six. So you're gonna take a number one ship and a number six ship off the board. Sorry, a, a number a number one and a number three ship off the board. Yeah. And then we're going to have the player one roll, and you will have a final player two turn. Oh, good. Whew. Let's go 12, Ryan. 12, 12, uh, 10. Here comes the player one roll. 12. It is a one and a five, total of six. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> one and a five, total of six. And I do not have now a We chart. get to roll. Finally, this is our final roll. Oh, this that is the worst. That was the worst. <laughs> Nine. I run the game. I'm rolling. Oh, I can do a four to five. All right, and then you're gonna roll for yourself. That was terrible. Good. Roll for yourself. <laughs> 12. Twelve coins. Ooh, I'm just gonna it. buy this one. Seven. For four. Um. Okay, that's gonna get one. me. Oh man. That's gonna get me to eleven space box. What? What do you have? Oh, wow. I'm gonna buy no. Reaver. No. <laughs> I'm gonna buy an output. Oh, Last thing man. Do is do. Just taking three points. Melissa. <laughs> All right. Are we ready for a final scoring round? Yep. I have 20 victory points. Luke Petersman, mm -hmm. how many do you have? Oh, uh, uh, get me last. No. Nope. All right. I'm done. Rose, I'm good. I have 26, but go somewhere else first. 15. 26 and 15. 15. John Zinser, how many do you have? I have 26. John Claire. Uh, 18. 18. All right. Melissa. 32. Oh. And Kevin. 31. Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> so close and yet uh. so far. And I'm going to share with you guys some scores from the chat. Sarah's awesome. has 46. Woo. Nice. Congratulations. Has 24. Allison has 15 and 1. Thomas has 15. Mark has 22. Fiona says Fiona 33. Amy 15. Amy has 26. David 27. Jay's, I, uh, Jay's asking if it, there is no role for player 3. Mike has 34. Jay has 26. And that's all the scores I have for right now. Awesome. Ooh, Congratulations. Congratulations Good scores. All right, Good everybody. Good job, everybody. Not one ten. <laughs> I know. I'm with you, John. Um, I'm going to be packing boxes wow. all day long, and that's all John's going to say. <laughs> you guys are no tens. <laughs> yeah. All right. Good game, everybody. Thanks. Yeah. So good game. Oh, Ryan's back. Ryan's back. back on space. space. All right, everybody. Thank you so much for playing today. We really appreciate it. It was great to see you all. Stay safe. We'll be back on Monday with more Tiny Towns. Thanks again to our special guest from Tantrum House. Thanks for having us. Thank you. All right. Bye, Live long everyone. and prosper. Everybody. Bye. Bye. Thank you. But what score was I thinking about? That's the